My name is Andrew Martin. I'm Head of Business Development in the Welsh Government, working particularly within the food and drink sector. Strategically, we've put together three main cluster groups. We have the Seafood Cluster, the Fine Food Cluster and the Nutri Wales Cluster. And these were developed to maximise economic growth within Wales, but also as a response against areas where we could see the sectors actually needed direct support as well. There are two essences of it. The first is for strategic Welsh Government, it's an economic development tool. It drives businesses to higher growth. For businesses, it's about an opportunity to understand where they might be able to grow and also understand where their competitors are and also where they might be able to save some money as well. So we meet every two months and we talk about um, you know, what's, what's been happening in our business, what challenges we've faced and um, we offer solutions to each other and those little gems of knowledge can be just worth such a lifeline to us to help solve problems within our own business. The reason why we joined it is, is it's simple really, it's, it's a great way to just feed off everyone. We've got wealth of knowledge between us all. We're all small to medium companies and we learn from each other where we, where we need to have contacts or sort of anything that we need and it's quite a nice sort of casual way to have a good discussion and great presentations to say that we need to look at this part whether we need to go into, into London or if we need to target more in South Wales or just Wales as a whole. What kind of distributors do we need to use? Who's best for this? Who's best for that? Um, and the same thing for the export really. That's, that's what the cluster is all about. You know, it's, it's working together, Welsh food companies together. One of the core concepts of clusters is the development of trust. There is knowledge within a business that you would never share with anybody. However, there is a range of other things that you might share. So what you're doing through the cluster process is you're trying to demonstrate trust and openness so that eventually the businesses that attend will start to open up more. And you can see it, it's, it's a really interesting facet of, of what we do. It's great to bounce ideas off everyone. So you can, you can come in and you can, if you've got a new idea or a new product, you can speak to everyone and they can give you their feedback because they're all, they're all in the same thing. They're doing new product development all the time. So they're great people to, to talk to about and get advice from. Say we are looking for packaging and somebody else is looking for packaging, we might get better deals by sort of ordering a pallet of it maybe. We could also work together by doing little parcels of different little foods, that cheese, biscuits, salami, that they all work together. I, I also feel with the cluster that there's no competition there. Everybody's quite willing to help everybody else, whatever stage we're at. Uh, we're all very different. Even though perhaps there's two companies doing charcuterie products, we're all so different. And everything, absolutely anything that I feel that I'd like to learn more on to move forward as a business, there's somebody here with that experience. It's great, actually. I feel as if we're part of a team, but a very high-class team. I just love being a part of it, very proud to be a part of it.